Sphinx Festival is truly uh, a good representation of the essence of Egyptian life, past and present, which is the festivity. In Egypt, there are 3,000 festivals, or they call them mulid, a year, and they represent union between the spirits of the past and the spirits of the present. The music and dance is an important part of this tradition. It is not just an entertainment. They are capable of blending uh, the mundane and the sacred into a very happy atmosphere where they can accomplish both. It's been a fantastic experience coming to the festival and I think all of these different aspects that have been brought together have been very enriching for the participants. Um, incredible experts in music and dance are here communicating and inspiring along with Egyptologists and many speakers in many disciplines and it's a privilege to be associated with it. When I was studying the folklore long ago, like 40 years, more than 40 years ago, I went to every place. When the Reda troop came out, it introduced the people to a new art form, theater dance. <laughs> Sultan Qaid Bey, one of the latest uh, uh, Mamluk sultans of the Circassian period, he was the first one to try and create an Egyptian line, Egyptian style of art and architecture. Nefertiti was the wife of Akhenaten, and some people think that she was also his successor, that she ruled for a while as a king, as a monarch, after him. All the spiritual ceremonies are led by women with frame drums. enjoy the music and dance of this very ancient land.